For the people of Yixing, there's no better way to show kindness and hospitality than by serving a cup of tea. This simple gesture is all anyone needs to feel right at home. Yangxian tea is the pride of Yixing. So it's no wonder residents here have been serving it since the years of the Tang Dynasty. From then on, a trio of teas that include Yangshan, Bilochun, and Longjing has been served as tributes to the imperial courts by this region. Yixing houses a wealth of agricultural riches, and these riches include an abundance of tea gardens. When it comes to production, Yixing outputs the highest amount of tea in Jiangsu province. So, what makes this region the perfect place to grow these delicate leaves? Well, for starters, its well-balanced ecology is ideal for plantation. Ultimately, it is these exquisite tea leaves that drive Yixing's economy. Tea plucking may seem like a simple job, but don't be fooled. It does come with its share of difficulties, and the task must be completed before the arrival of the spring rains. It is crucial that plucking takes place at exactly the right time of the year. Here's how tea plucking works. You hold the top of the leaf with your finger, then pull it up ever so gently. And there you have it, a piece of tea leaf that's been plucked successfully. Even though all these leaves may look alike, a tea grower will tell you, we should respect every single leaf because it is harvested through the hardworking hands of the common people. The best part of the tea growing process is, of course, drinking it. Anyone in Yixing will tell you, if you want to learn how to make the perfect cup of tea, all you have to do is sit down and enjoy it. Brewing that perfect cup is all about trial and error. As they say here, to live in Yixing is the best way to know tea. In Yixing alone, there are dozens of tea varieties. Generally, they're divided into two camps. One is green, the other black. But this doesn't mean categorizing these teas is that simple. Because of the variations in color and taste, at home, people like to sort their teas in a number of different ways. The people of Yixing love drinking their tea out of a clay teapot. There's a popular saying in Yixing, and it goes something like this. When God gave Yixing a teapot, he did not forget to drop a tea leaf in it as well. Here are the basics of making that delicious brew. First, you need to warm things up. This involves pouring hot water on both the teapot and teacup. Secondly, your first cup of tea is never meant for drinking, but rather for smelling. This is known as tea smelling. With its aromatic scent and therapeutic benefits, it's no wonder the people of Yixing are so passionate about their tea. Yixingers know that anyone who visits here will be greeted with a warm smile. And no doubt, a delicious cup of tea.